So do you know that you can remotely control your other Echo device inside your home? Well, yes, you can. So for instance, say you have music playing in your living room and you decide to go to the bedroom. You don't feel like going back to the living room to turn off the one that's playing in the living room. So you can wake up the one that's in the room you're in right now and just tell it to tell the other one in the living room to stop playing the music. So it will be just like this. After you use the wake word to wake up the one you're in, you will say stop playing music on the living room echo show or stop playing music on the living room echo. And the one that you just gave the command is going to send that command over to the living room echo or echo show, whichever one is in that living room and the music is going to stop playing. So you can change the volume. You can do all kinds of different things. So just try it. So if you didn't know that you can remotely control your echo devices and your echo show, now you know. So you can set anything remotely. You can set alarms, you can set timers. Even if you're not in that room, you can set a timer for something else in another room. And you can also silent the alarm if the timer goes off remotely. So you can stop the one in the kitchen if you set a 10 minute timer in the kitchen and you're in another room, you can just tell the one that's in the room you're in right now to tell the other one in whatever room it is to stop the timer. All right, so that's gonna be it for this quick tip. Go ahead and give it a shot and see how well it works for you. If you like this tip, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I wanna thank you for taking the time for watching this video. Have a good one and I'll see you next time.